and the shirt says, I believe, balls deep. He says his name is Captain Awesome. <laughs> I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. I feel threatened. You make in contact with the subject on school property. Um, stand by. How you doing, sir? I'm Officer Rodriguez with the Georgetown Police Department. I see your identification. I believe you're on school property, and I don't believe you're allowed to be on school property. School property, school property is private property. Is public property paid for by the taxpayers? I have every right to be on here. I would. Here's what I'm. Before you lose your qualified immunity, I think you should uh, reach out to Lieutenant Worsham. Tell him, Doctor, you, Lieutenant Worsham, work rector. I have his email. Okay. This is 100% public okay. property. I have every right to be here. You're going to lose your qualified immunity, and I'm going to sue you if you try to move me off public property. And Texas is not an ID state. You have no right to ask me for an ID unless I've committed a crime. Okay. So, let's start over. So, based on the information I have, no protesters are allowed on school property. School property is not public property. Pro school property, property is owned by the school district. That's Which is paid for okay. by taxpayers' dollars. Number two. You've got to Google public Number property. Number two. I'm, the reason I'm asking you for identification is because based on that assumption, with that information that I have at hand, you're committing the criminal act of criminal trespassing. No, I have Once to Once you commit a criminal act or a suspicion of a criminal act, the failure to ID no. or a law applies and to request That's your a secondary ID. charge. So... Secondary no, charge. Uh, the primary 3802. charge... 3802. What is 3802 saying? The primary, charge, the primary say? charge is criminal trespassing. What is 3802? And before I can continue my investigation of criminal trespassing, I'm not I talking to you anymore. identification. No. May I ask for your identification, nope. sir? Because you're you on can school ask. property. I'm not going to give it to you. That's fine, sir. No problem. Do you, you want to give me your name or anything like that? I'm not going to give you anything. I don't even have to talk to you. Okay. Here's what's going to happen. I guarantee you, by the time I get home, this is going to be uploaded That's to fine. your chief. And That's you're going to learn about 3802. Okay. You're going to learn but about we're not losing here for your... 3802. 3802. What is 3802? failure to ID. I'm here for criminal <laughs> trespassing and criminal trespassing. I have to be warned. Okay. I have so, to be warned first. Oh, okay. Before, yeah. Okay. So here's the thing. So, so the information is incorrect that not, none of the trespassers were warned to stay over there for the rest of your colleagues on public property, what which is a sidewalk. Is that? What, what penal code? What penal code? sidewalk over there. But you what said warned. Code? What penal code? And so have you been warned before? What penal code? Have you been warned before? Give me a statute. You stated that you needed to be warned before. How many, then, how then many complaints with IA do you have? Then why don't we do this? How many complaints with IA do you have? Then I'm going to politely ask you to step off. And I'm going to deny because of the way you came up. Because of the way you came up. There with the rest of your colleagues, city properties anywhere from the sidewalk in the easement onto the street, public street. Who funds who funds who funds school districts? Not a problem, sir. Who funds school districts? Okay. Call no. you lieutenant before you get a big lawsuit. No problem. Go ahead and stay here as of right now you're being detained for criminal trespassing and failure to ID. Okay? <laughs> okay, then i I refuse to talk. Answer, sir, have, have you have you ever heard of public school? Have you ever heard of public school? I have a child here. Okay. What are they going to do? I'd love for you to kick me off this so I could sue you. Please, lock me up. Do it. I would love it. If you're here, it would be a hundred thousand dollars easy. To your parent, uh, I don't. To your and you know what? I don't have to. Right. And I don't have to disclose any of that to you. Okay. I don't. I don't have to talk to you at all. Okay. You're lucky I even talk to you whatsoever. But you know what your, I wanted to do? Kindness. I wanted to offer the education because you need it. And when you're out there in my community talking to people the way you are, it hurts. You ever heard of community policing? Yes. So do me a favor. Google Google public school. See who funds it. And it's my tax dollars. And then that means you don't have a right to tell people to leave. Okay. It's not a private building. Okay. And this, and this is, is the First Amendment. Of freedom of speech. I hope you're not a training officer. It's gonna look horrible on you. Horrible. Instead of you apologizing and making this better, you just want to stand there like, oh, I'm right. And you're gonna be wrong. And you're gonna do, you're gonna leave before I do. You're probably not gonna apologize. Because I'm guessing you're not the man who will admit their mistakes and say, you know what, sir, in public? I'm going to tell you. Uh -huh.
what mm -hmm. I am doing mm -hmm. is that I'm verifying the information that you gave me. But that this is public? And have that, you ever heard of the term public school? That's just a yes right. or no. Have that's, you ever heard? That's why I'm not going to have a conversation with you because, because I'm trying to interact with you and I'm trying to explain to you what I'm trying to do. Yeah. The legal process that I'm trying to do. Contacting this. Where'd you get your law degree from? Then? Contacting the, the school district employees so that we can get to the bottom of the information if you're actually allowed to be on property. I have Dr. Ben's cell phone right here. I and, emailed them earlier today. Do you want to call them? And so then we can go ahead and we can either allow you to do that and I can get back in my car and go. It's the First or Amendment. Or if not, then we can go to proceed forward with... It's the First Amendment. And then the identification. Do, do you understand... And then the okay, do you okay. understand for somebody to be so trespassed, so they do. have to be asked to leave? Do you understand that? This is a legal question. Do you understand that? I'm asking because I'm guessing you have no clue. I, I, I think I've already tried to explain has anybody asked me to leave? Has anybody really asked me to leave? Being very oh my goodness. You know what? Your dereliction of duty. You're literally going to lose your qualified immunity for this. Breaking, <laughs> violating civil rights is a federal offense. All right. And you know what? I'm going to go after your license too. I guarantee you, come tomorrow, there'll be a T-close investigation starting tomorrow. And you sit there like you don't care. I'm doing nothing. I'm on public property. I was holding the sign, waiting for my child at school. And you have a problem with that? Ridiculous. This stoner right over there, they'll be with us in just a minute and then we'll be able to conclude our interaction. Okay? I know stoner. Thank you very much for being patient. I know, it. no, but here's, the, here's something else. This is important. You said I was detained. Do you know what, you know what the Supreme Court says the, the length of detainment should be? 10 minutes. Okay. You, you're not detained. Oh, anymore. okay. Amazing. Okay. Had I not even not said that, had I not even said that, it would have been another federal violation for you. You should look it up. It's Thank 10 minutes. Oh, so let me, I've got to ask you this. For, for, no, hold on. He detained me. I need to know what for, for my record. I need to know why I was detained. Come on, buddy. You just said I was breaking the law on public property. You're gonna get educated for free.